Hi Carol, just wanted to wish you a happy retirement from all your friends and family members here at uh, our place and to thank you for all your support over the years. You've really stepped up for us again and again with the TRC and other programs and projects here and helped our family members and helped our community and have even come in and served and volunteered here as well. So we really appreciate everything you've done for us over many many years and I just want to to thank you uh, for that and to wish you a really happy uh, retirement and a blessed time you take care Carol thank you again hi Carol I just wanted to take the time to say thank you for all of your support uh, for our place and our family members here over the years from coming uh, to meals and helping serve meals and interacting with our folks. The ID clinics which is, was such a, is, is continues to be such a huge, uh, uh, have such a large impact for our family members. So I just wanted to say on behalf of our family members, our staff, volunteers and myself, just a, a large thing. Thank you for all the work that you've done uh, over many, many years and, and your continued support of, of our place. Thank you for all your support and we're going to miss you. God bless. Hi Carol. I just wanted to say thank you very much for all your support of the family here at our place and uh, I wish you all the best in uh, your escape from politics and into your, your new life. Um, it's been fantastic working with you over these years um, for everything that you've done for the family members here and uh, we really, really appreciate it. Thank you. Stand by me, Carol. That should have been your theme song. Mark Rose from our place. I do remember meeting you when I saw you in action at the Canadian Federation of University Women and you stood up for what women could do with childcare breaks. And then I saw you stand by your son who is in recovery, which is where I'm standing right now in the New Roads uh, Therapeutic Recovery Community. And my colleague Bronwyn, when I was at the Victoria Foundation, and you stood by your son, Evan, who's now running a recovery home, just amazing. And a sister to one of the people we have up on our wall at our place in our dining room, you stood by your brother. Um, you stood by your husband chief and have a reconciliation lens for the steps we have to take with First Nations. Um, you stood by so many foster children. Um, now we want to stand by you as you take this next turn in your career and anytime you want to come down and have a meal and feel a sense of family and hope and belonging, we're here for you. Take care. Thanks very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.